up sun rays welcome back to my channel it's ray if you're new here welcome today i am going to be doing another twist out using the texture id multi-styling foam guys i did not plan on doing a twist out today but my hair dryer broke the brand new one that i just got broke so i don't know what's going on with me and hair dryers well i didn't do anything to it so because of that, I cannot do a wash and go or any type of set style where I need to dry my hair. So with that said, we're gonna do this twist out and we're gonna hope that my hair gets dry by tomorrow. So I've already washed and conditioned my hair. For my leave-in, I use the Texture ID 3 times Moisture Conditioner as my leave-in. And now I'm gonna go in with the mousse and it does come out in a nice foam. And that was just one pump. That was actually kind of like a half a pump. So we're gonna apply that. And I hope these things mix well. And we're just gonna start twisting and hope for the best. With that being said, let me ask you, have you guys used this mousse before? And let me know what you think about it. Now, I have used this mousse for a mousse only wash and go, but I believe I used the setting cream underneath it. Um, but I don't think I've used it for a twist out. So we're gonna see how that works today. And I'm using the leave-in as my, I mean, I'm sorry, the three times moisture conditioner as my leave-in. That's one pump. And this mousse is very creamy. So I will say that it has a very nice, creamy, soft, silky texture to it. Very nice. So I'm just gonna keep twisting and hope my hair dries by tomorrow. So yeah, that's it guys. You guys seen me twist before. So um, I'm just gonna continue to do this all over my head and I'll be back. Okay guys, so I am finished adding my twist, but um, I did want to let you know that I did trim off a little bit of hair. If you can see here, see the little frayed ends there? When I see those, I just kinda clip them off not much but a little bit just so it looks a little bit better so i did do that see here's another one so my ends look just a little bit better but anyway so this is my hair got it all twisted up i twisted it a little bit differently than i normally do we're gonna see how it uh turns out but anyway, got the twist in. Guys, I really like the feel of this Texture ID styling foam. It has wheat protein and argan oil in it. It's just really thick filling and just creamy and moisturized uh, filling. So yeah, let's hope that it has a hold and will keep my hair. And let's hope it's quick drying because I need my hair dry tomorrow and it's already late in the day. It is 4.05 and I normally do my hair in the mornings, but things happened. Then the dryer broke and everything, so I wasn't able to. But anyway, just wanted to show you. So here are the little clippings that I took off my ends. Not much, but I know you guys be wanting to know because people are always saying, do you cut your hair a lot? Do you cut your hair a lot? Because it's always the same length. So this time I cut it while it's in the twist so I wasn't trying to shape it up and I would cut a little bit less. But anyway, that's it guys. I'm gonna go ahead and let my hair air dry. I will be back for the takedown, so stay tuned. All right, sun rays, it is the next day and I'm in a hurry again. Don't believe my hair is all the way dry, so I apologize, but I have to take it down. Um, blame it on my hair dryer. So I'm gonna rush through this real quick. My husband is waiting on me. We're just gonna take these down real quick. I will say, using this mousse, these twists dried so beautifully. See how nice and straight they are? They look plump, they look shiny. So I did notice that on drying. I hate that it's not completely dry, that it has not even had a good 24 hours to sit. It's dry to the touch, but you know how it is in some of the thicker areas. It's a little bit damp. So I'm not gonna do a whole lot of separating 
because I don't want to freeze it out too much. So. I will say right now I do feel um, a little stickiness on my hands and I don't know if it's because it's not all the way dry or because of the products I used. Um, to cleanse. Because my hair did not, uh, my hands didn't feel real sticky when I was applying the product. definition for it not to have set for 24 hours and by my voice I know you can tell that it's early in the morning I was going to try to leave them up and put on a scarf or something but I don't know how to tie scarves I didn't have, I don't have enough scarves to match the stuff that I wear and it was just a whole thing. And then I said, well, I could just take down the front and put on a headband wig, which is what I should have done. But then I thought, you know what? No, we're going to go ahead and just test, test these out. The fact that I'm rushing through these and not getting a whole lot of free, it says a lot about this combo. Okay, there we go. Guys, my hair looks so shiny, so dark. Um, Uh-oh, got a twist. And minimal frizz, considering that I'm rushing through this takedown and it didn't have long to dry. It has a hold, so I do feel like this twist out will definitely um, last. There's no crunch, but there's definitely a hold. This this probably has the um, strongest hold I've used so far in the mousses that I've used. So I will say that, guys, I have to go. So I'm not gonna do a whole lot. What I am gonna do is, this is pretty much what it looks like day one. Of course, I'll do a little bit more fluffing in the car, put on my earrings and everything, but you can see the definition but what I will do is come back on day three and let you guys see my day three results. So stay tuned. Okay guys, just wanted to pop in real quick. <sighs> back home, been out in the elements and my hair is holding up quite nicely. So just wanted to um, let you see it after I got back from the elements. So I will, like I said, come back on day three 
and give you my thoughts on day three. So stay tuned. All right, guys, just popping in to show you my third day hair. So this is it. Um, not doing a lot today, just at home editing. So I haven't really done a whole lot to my hair. I basically just took it out of the bonnet and zhuzhed it up with my fingers or whatever. And um, yeah, so I'm just coming to you because I don't plan on going anywhere today um, unless it's just out to walk. So I'm not, you know, putting on a whole lot of makeup and earrings and everything like that. I just want to let you see the hair. So as you can see, the definition is still there. I still have a whole lot of coils that could actually be pulled apart. I do have some frizz here around my edges where the um, my night bonnet is or, you know, sometimes when I wash my face, which, you know, I did do today, it gets a little bit wet. And so it's a little bit frizzy there, but it still has a lot of definition, as you can see. I will say that this particular mousse, the Texture ID mousse, has more hold than a lot of the other mousses do that I have tried. That leave-in and that mousse together gave me some nice hold. My hair still has some shine to it. It still looks pretty healthy. Um, I'm just moving it around so you guys can see. I still don't have any flaking or anything like that, but this is definitely a twist out that I can pull apart, shape it up, doll myself up, and go. I could actually keep this twist out probably for the rest of this week. As you can see, it has a lot of definition. So I recommend the Texture ID Mousse. If you haven't tried it, I say pick it up and give it a try. I am going to wash my hair. I'm not gonna keep it all week because I do wanna try out some new products. I'm trying to get through um, my products and my reviews so I can try to have most of the items that I got for Black Friday reviewed before um, the end of the year. So yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna stretch this to the end of the week. I am gonna wear it today. Like I said, I don't think I'm going anywhere, but my husband's not here. He may want to go to dinner or something. And I may try to wash it tomorrow, which is fourth day. If not, I definitely will wash it the next day. So this is gonna last at least a good five days for me. Today is day three, and y'all see the definition. Look at that coil. Y'all see the definition. So anyway, yeah, just wanted to pop in and show you my third day hair again. Haven't haven't shaped it, so don't look at the shape. It is kind of wild, but I just wanted you to see the definition. The moisture is still there. The softness is still there, so the moisture did last, and it actually lasted longer than I thought because I used a... Um, conditioner that has silicones in it so I wasn't sure how well my leave-in was going to penetrate but so far so good so I will say that and yeah let me know if you um, have tried these products if you like these products let me know what you think about them in the comment section below let me know what you think about this twist out and how it lasted and if you like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in my next one bye guys